hello my dear students today we are going to start again our online classes so let's start the our first chapter is geography chapter number 9 and the chapter name is life in the desert so what is desert we have to know about the desert Desert is an arid region characterized by extremely high or low temperature and has scarce vegetation. Desert is a particular place which receives extremely weather. Maybe it is very hot or maybe it is very cold. Desert is always not only the hot places, it is also cold places. Later I will analyze why it is hot and cold and also it receives very scarce vegetation there is very little vegetation happens we will learn about the places in the world where people have learned to cope with extreme harsh temperature in which place are hot fire some are cold as ice so in extreme temperature some places are very high such as uh, 50 degrees celsius high and some places receives very cold it is like just like minus 50 degree also sometimes you will find that's why the desert is divided into two parts which is hot desert and cold desert hot desert now we will read about the hot desert the hot desert sahara sahara is you know the world largest desert in the uh, world largest desert the total area of sahara is 8.54 million square kilometers now you imagine how big it is 8.54 million square kilometer and do you know the um, total area of india it is only 3.2 million square kilometer almost three times bigger than india the sahara desert is three times bigger than india the sahara desert touches 11 countries total it has touches 11 countries and these are algeria chad egypt libya mali mauritania morocco niger sudan tunisia and western sahara these 11 countries has touched by the Sahara Desert. Now you have to remember the total area of Sahara Desert is 8.54 million square kilometer and the total area of India is 3.2 million square kilometer. Sahara has touched 11 countries and the name is given there. You have to write, you have to uh, remember it, you have to memorize it. In some places, all the Sahara Desert is not same and not plain. There are some rocky places. There are some high latitude places. Some places are 2500 meter high at uh, some places. So with this, the all, entire Sahara Desert is wasted. And the next page, just a minute. Yeah. see the sahara desert this is the sahara desert and it has touched touched 11 countries and the country's name is given there country's name is you can see you can see these places sudan egypt libya algeria mauritania and western sahara this is entire sahara desert i am just showing you by this arrow One important thing, once upon a time, this Sahara Desert was a evergreen places. There was, uh, in ancient time, we will, uh, uh, archaeologists found that there were some eggs of uh, crocodiles, elephants, bones also found. It means it, it was the place where people used to live and there was various types of animals used to live. But by the time when the rivers diverted from these regions, 
the place becomes a dangerous desert now climate the Sahara's climate is very dangerous because at the daytime it receives 50 degrees Celsius hot can you imagine we uh, if there is only 35 degrees Celsius hot then we are unable to stay there we, we are facing tremendous problem but Sahara desert at the daytime 50 degree Celsius hot and at the night time it receives 0 degree Celsius 0 degree means there will be the possibility of ice so this is the climate of Sahara now flora and fauna flora means what vegetation the mm, trees and fauna means species so in vegetation vegetation in the sahara desert includes cactus dates palm and acacia as you know that in the uh, hot desert these types of things are found cactus dates palms and acacia beside these we will uh, found some kinds of animals that is the sheep of the desert is called camel camel is also called the sheep of the desert Hyenas, jackals, foxes, scorpions, many varieties of animals you will found in the Sahara Desert. Now you see there, do you know, scientists have actually found skeleton of fish in this desert, what could have happened that means once upon a time there was some big big ponds and lakes and rivers that's why they found the skeleton of fishes also it means once upon a time i told you this place was a evergreen place and various types of animals and people also used to live there but by the time it's diverted now people of sahara sahara's peoples they are called Bedouins and to to two rigs towerigs towerigs so these are the nomadic types uh, nomadic type means the people used to live in particular place for the particular season they have not any settled home but nowadays all are settled there is no bedouins god sheep camel and horses are their main livestock by these they collect some uh, milks from them they make butter ghee all these things and from their looms from their hairs they used to make mat carpets uh, cloths and all other things now oasis in the sahara and nail valley in egypt support settled population the settled population comes in the oasis Oasis is a place where you will find some water. And Nail is the only river and it is the longest river of the world, Nail. So in these two regions, you will find settled population. And nowadays, uh, with the uh, uh, invention of minerals, I mean oil and other things, people used to live there and there are so many highways government make to people for the settlement of people so many high buildings towers and all other things government make for the settlement of people now in the sahara desert is not like the earlier sahara desert people are using this sahara desert for various purposes so all these we will study we have studied in this chapter and in the next class i will discuss about the cold desert so today up to that much is our class so first of all you have i am giving you some homework and you have to write the answer and send it to the whatsapp group and the homework is how many the, you have to write the question and uh, i am just saying you how many countries are touched by the Sahara Desert name them again how many countries are touched by the Sahara Desert name them
which next question which type of animals are found in sahara desert these two question you have to write the answer from today's class and then send it to the whatsapp group so up to that much is our today's class thank you